بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم In the name of Allah the most compassionate most merciful Amin This is a revelation from the most compassionate most merciful It is a book whose verses are perfectly explained a Quran in Arabic for people who know delivering good news and warning yet most of them turn away so they do not hear they say our hearts are railed against what you are calling us to there is deafness in our ears and there is a barrier between us and you so do whatever you want and so shall we say o prophet i am only a man like you but it has been revealed to me that your god is only one god so take the straight way towards him and seek his forgiveness and walk to the polytheists those who do not pay arms tax and are in denial of hereafter but those who believe and do good will certainly have a never ending reward ask them o prophet How can you disbelieve in the one who created the earth in two days and how can you set up equals with him that is the lord of all worlds he placed on the earth firm mountains standing high showered his blessings upon it and ordained all its means of sustenance totaling four days exactly for all who ask then he turned towards the heaven when it was still like smoke saying to it and to the earth submit willingly or unwillingly they both responded we submit willingly so he formed the heaven into seven heavens in two days assigning to each its mandate and we adorned the lowest heaven with stars like lamps for beauty and for protection that is the design of the almighty or knowing if they turn away then say o prophet I warn you of a mighty blast like the one that befell Ar then Thamud the messengers had come to them from all angles proclaiming worship none but Allah they responded had our lord willed he could have easily sent down angels instead so we totally reject what you have been sent with as for Ar they acted arrogantly throughout the land with no right boasting who is superior to us in might did they not see that allah himself who created them was far superior to them in might still they persisted in denying our signs so we sent against them a furious wind for several miserable days to make them taste a humiliating punishment in this worldly life but far more humiliating will be the punishment of the hereafter and they will not be helped As for Thamud we showed them guidance but they preferred blindness over guidance so the blast of a disgracing punishment overtook them for what they used to commit and we delivered those who were faithful and were mindful of Allah consider the day when the enemies of Allah will be gathered for the fire all driven in ranks when they reach it their ears eyes and skin will testify against what they used to do they will ask their skin furiously why have you testified against us it will say we have been made to speak by allah who causes all things to speak he is the one who created you the first time and to him you were bound to return you did not bother to hide yourselves from your ears eyes and skin to prevent them from testifying against you rather you assumed that allah did not know much of what you used to do it was that false assumptions that you entertain about your lord that has brought about your doom so you have become losers even if they endure patiently the fire will always be their home and if they beg to appease their lord they will never be allowed to We placed at their disposal evil associates who made their past and future misdeeds appealing to them so the fate of earlier communities of jinn and humans 
has been justified against them as well, for they were truly losers. The disbelievers advised one another, Do not listen to this Quran, but drown it out, so that you may prevail. So we will certainly make the disbelievers taste a severe punishment, and we will surely repay them according to the worst of their deeds. That is the reward of Allah's enemies, the fire, which will be their eternal home, a fitting reward for their denial of our revelations. The disbelievers will then cry, Our Lord, show us those jinn and humans who led us astray. We will put them under our feet so that they will be among the lowest in hell.